Welcome. In this video, we are going to continue our journey with Flat and uh, learn how we can develop Flutter applications in Python. And we are going to see in this video how you can get user input. So one way is to use event handlers and checkboxes and uh, text boxes and drop downs and so on. So for example, if we import Flat, and from flat we import the icon button the page the row the text field and the icons after that we can create our main function with the page and we can say that the page that title is going to be example and the page that vertical alignment equals center and the text number is going to be a text field with the value of zero and the text align is going to be right and the width is going to be 100 and the minus is going to take an event and we will say that the text number that value is equal to the integer text number dot value minus one and the page that update has to be called and we can have the plus and this will increase the counter and to the page we can add something called row and this row is going to have the icon button and icons that remove and on click we will have the minus and it will also have the text number and it will also have the icon button icons.add with the on click equals to plus and then we can say that the alignment is equal to center and this is closed and the flat dot app can run with the target of main and uh, yeah so let's go ahead and run it python user input and the text align it has a typo great all right, now we have our small application and if I click the plus, it will increase. If I click the minus, it will decrease. And that's it. And the second example is going to be the user input to that py. And from flat, uh, we would like to import the elevated button, the text and the text field. And we would like to import flat as well. And we define our main with the page. And we will have the button click with the event. If not, the text underscore name that value then we can say that the text name that error text equals please enter your name and we can call the page update otherwise we can say that the name is the text name that value 
we can call the page that clean and add to the page the text welcome name and uh, we will have the text name which is equal to text field and it will have the label your name and the page that add gets the text name the elevated button with the say hello and on click we call the button click and we will use the flat that app with the target main all right now let's run our user input too and once we have the application open we can say hello with when we have the error message enter your name when it's empty and if i enter something it will say that we are welcome all right that was all i wanted to show you see you in the next one